Hello ladies and gentlemen. Um, for those of you who don't know me, my name is Linda and I have the honor of making this speech for one of my dearest friends, Shotzi. I remember when Shotzi first told me about Mikhail and how she met a man from Sweden in Singapore while on a work assignment from the United States. Now I'm not Swedish and I often confuse Sweden and Switzerland, I'm sorry. <laughs> but thanks to Shotzi, I know more now than I did a few years ago. For starters, it's the land of ABBA, meatballs, and surprisingly complicated furniture assembly instructions. But more importantly, it's where my dear friend calls home with her now husband. Good evening, everyone. Let me reintroduce myself. My name is Emilio, and my... Oh my God, my daughter is so gorgeous today, so... Hi, everyone. My name is Nnedi, and I'm Shashi's mom. And um, my husband and I are so happy and grateful that we are all gathered here to celebrate the big event of Shatsi and Mikhail. So in the email they said that the speech should be two to three minutes. Um, so we'll try to, to hold to that. We'll see how it goes. Shatsi, you're an amazing array of sunshine, shining with both light and warmth. It's easy to see that you're made for each other. And it's an incredible luxury for us that you moved to Sweden so we can be more involved in your lives. Shotzi, you are the love of my life and my best friend. You're everything I ever wanted in a partner. You're kind, smart, beautiful, and you always put everyone else above yourself. From this day forward, I promise to always be there for you. I promise to dream with you, celebrate with you, cry with you, and walk beside you through whatever life brings. Mikkel, when people hear our story, they usually say how hard it must have been to be over 6,000 kilometers away from each other with a six hour time zone difference and to wait two and a half years just to be together. But knowing you were on the other side of all of those things made them all easy. And if I had to do it all over again to be with you, I would do it in a heartbeat. Mikkel, you are truly one of God's greatest blessings to me and the people in your life. You are generous with your time and energy. You think about the well-being of your loved ones often. And you are so positive and kind. Thank you for all the times you have comforted me, made me laugh, and reminded me of my value when I feel low. To know Shotzi is to know her tenacity, her drive, and her ambition. But honestly, most of all, it's to know her warm affection. All this to say, Mikael is a very lucky man. I was so honored when Shotzi asked me to be her maid of honor. I hope you all can tell that I would go to the ends of the earth for this woman. And it's because I have been so blessed with her friendship. So please join me in raising a glass for a final toast. May your love be blessed and everlasting. As we say in Tagalog, Tagay! Let's party! Thank you! Woo!